So here we are folks with match 43, it's South Korea up against Germany. So South Korea will start like this, Jin Chun in goal, Jung Hyo, Yong Guan, Tai Hui, Ki Hi, Kin Ho, Song Yun, Jia Cho, Hyung Min, Dong Won and Shin Wook up front. As for Germany, Noyo you in goal, Hurvides, Boateng, Kimmich, Hummels, Kroos, Draxler, Ozil, Kahn, Muller and Werner up front. So the match is underway. Germany in the traditional black pants and white top. This is match number 43, which will take place on the 27th of June in the Kazan Arena in Kazan. Now kick off the exact same time as Mexico versus Sweden. Now this group is positioned like thus. Germany currently top the pops with six points. And I'm just trying to think if have they qualified. I think they have qualified uh, they cannot be caught I'm just I think uh, South Korea take a sharp lead in the first minute of the game and that puts a little bit of a spin on things in regards to uh, this the runners-up spot because Germany would top this group they'd make their throughs Dong Won with the goal scorer uh, as South Korea have now put the put the Germans the uh, world champions under a bit of pressure now can they get themselves back into this game we'll, talk, we'll find out in a bit but let's take a look at, let's, let's think about the uh, the ins and the outs here of of uh, the group qualifying Germany has six points and as it stands Korea will have four points Sweden have the opportunity to also get six points so Germany are there doesn't matter what happens in this game. Doesn't matter what happens in the Mexico Sweden game. It's just it, it will all. There is a little bit of a sway. Germany can end up as runners up, um, but all teams are still in it. As it stands, if Korea wins, Mexico will have to outscore them. Basically, score more goals than uh, South Korea. A draw for South Korea will eliminate them. They will be going home. Sweden will have be in the driving seat. So, yeah, it, it's, it's tight. It's a very evenly poised thing. Germany already in, in the bag, though. So let's recap some of these. So nearly a second. Let's recap some of the, uh, the, the, the results thus far. Germany opened up their account in Group F. When they beat Mexico 2-1, Sweden got themselves up to an opening day victory with a 1-0 win over South Korea. Then Korea took on Mexico and ended up in a 1-1 draw before Germany beat Sweden. 1-0. So Korea start this match with one point as do Mexico. Sweden have the three points and Germany have six and right now South Korea have a two goal lead over Germany. That pushes Germany's goal difference back down to zero. Pushes Korea's goal difference up to one with four points. Four points. So that would mean if the result was to, it's uh, I, I missed the score. I think it was Shimwook. Shimwook got the got the second goal there for South Korea. But if the result was to stay like this, uh, South Korea would be in a good position because Sweden would have to win. A draw would not be good enough for Sweden because of the goal difference, I believe. Germany though, there ain't no pushovers. Oh my goodness, nearly a third for South Korea. Nearly an absolute third. What is going on? <coughs> Long ball, excuse me. Korea look menacing. They've got the bit between the teeth. Good strike here, and it is. It's 3-0, people. South Korea are pissing over the world champions, Germany. They may already be thinking about the next round, but they're letting themselves down. They're letting this group down because Shin Wook has got a daily double. 3-0. I don't know. I, I'm speechless. Absolute speechless. Is it? Is it all plain? Is it over already? Is this game over?
Germany. Need a goal before half time. If you are new to the setup, we do play two four minute halves. And we're edging closer bit by bit to half time. Maybe a strike here. Good effort, but the keeper was equal to it. Big, big punt this time. Trying to get over the halfway line. No joy. South Korea now looking for a fourth goal. This is definitely the result of the round of the tournament. And they just put it just behind for a goal kick. If they could score from this, it will give them a bit of a bit of hope, Germany. But uh, to score three goals, turn and shoot. Oh, keeper is, is good and brave. So South Korea doing themselves uh, no harm at the moment with a plus two goal difference with four points on the board. And obviously Mexico have a chance. They would have to, um, oh my goodness. <laughs> that was a crack opportunity. Yeah, there could have been four, but South Korea look to go into half time here with a three nil lead. Just waiting for the final or the half time whistle. Germany looking. And it's over. South Korea free Germany nil. So Germany will kick off in the second half. Looking to get themselves back in this game. I think Joachim Löw will be a little bit pissed with that result. If it stands like this. A bit of a spanking. A bit of a football and lesson by the Asians. Now these two sides have met a few times over the years. When I say a few, I mean three. They met three times. And Germany have won two of them. The last time that these two sides did meet was all the way back in 2004. It was a friendly. Korea came out winners 3-1. <laughs> That's a nasty foul. Could go in the book. And he does. Kroos. Real Madrid midfielder. In the book for Germany. But the first time that these two sides met was back in 1994. It was a World Cup. 3-2 winners for Germany. And they also met in the 2002 World Cup. And Germany won 1-0 as well. So when these two sides have met in the World Cup, it's gone Germany's way. Headed onwards. Is there a bit of fight in the draw? I don't think so. I just don't see him coming back from 3-0 down. South Korea, though, want to do themselves uh, a good chance to get through here. Because the chances of Mexico thumping... That's another foul. Could be a red as well. No. Go on, have a shot. Have a shot. Good effort. But yeah, Mexico would then need to pretty much equal, if not beat, um, South Korea. The result between the two sides ended in a draw. So it will be one of those complicated matters, which I don't really want to happen. But I, I don't see it happening. I do not see Mexico doing it. Sweden, on the other hand... Just a 1-0 winner when Mexico will put them through. Uh, and they could even top the group. Because right now, Germany have a negative one goal difference. A negative one goal difference. Yeah. That's how bad a defeat this is for Germany. All that hard work getting a plus two goal difference has been wiped away by the craft and the guile of South Korea. looking to maybe at least level the playing field on the goal difference wise long ball thrown in Germany have just not been on it today a lot of the big heavyweights have struggled in this tournament we all know about Brazil we all know about Argentina we all know about Portugal also oh, just in case you are new and unfamiliar to this and you like to keep yourself up to date with my 16-bit retro edition of the uh, uh, 2018 World Cup the only way to keep yourself up to date is hitting the subscribe button and keep you bang up to date with all my games. So I am simulating each and every one of the World Cup games and I've done so from the get-go to this game right here. And, and to, in order to, to increase the searchability of this and if you've enjoyed this, make sure you hit the thumbs up video, thumbs up icon down towards the bottom end of the video. Uh, it does help uh, boost the video in the search uh, YouTube algorithm. Um, but yes, this channel is not just 16-bit uh, retro editions of FIFA. There's a lot of other football content on here. So, uh, you know, in order to stay in touch, hit the subscribe button, babies. And you'll uh, hear more from me. Last 30 seconds 
of the match. South Korea have been absolutely brilliant. They're looking for a fourth goal here. But it doesn't look like it's going to happen. It looks like, it looks like South Korea have done enough to at least make the Sweden-Mexico game mean something. Both sides will go into it with, with the possibility of getting through. Germany already there. We all know that. We are now edging closer. Germany will be a little bit embarrassed with this result. A lot of extra time. And there it is. South Korea free. Germany nil. Quick look at the statistics. Eight shots uh, for South Korea on the day. Three of them in the back of that. Germany only had the three. Uh, one corner. Just to recap, the goal scorers, two of them. Jin uh, Dong Wong opened up the scoring on 43 seconds before uh, a Shin Wok double. Two minutes and 12 seconds and two minutes and 50 seconds. As for the discipline. As for the discipline, Tony Cruz in the book for a yellow card. And after that result, here's an updated look at the table. Thanks again for watching. Please like, share, and of course, subscribe. Check back each and every day for some hot World Cup content.